who gets the possession here. Breaking ball, favours William O'Donnell. Does a little shimmy to the left, about to take a shot. Ball comes in towards Ava Quilligan. Leaves it go out, ball is wide. Quickly taken, there's still time on the clock. John Conlon sends it down the middle for Shane O'Donnell for the referee. No, he's no, calling with it back. that call, he wants the puck out to be taken properly. He does, it's not over. It's, it's the not bottles. over. The yeah. crowds are on the field, but they're going to have to be put back. Limerick are celebrating a one-point victory, but the referee has not blown his full-time whistle. He wanted the puck out to be taken by Ava Quilligan. Now, will, will he just blow the full-time whistle, or will he, in fact, get everybody off the field and play an extra minute? Brian Lohan is coming on and protesting with the referee. But Liam Gordon is saying, I think, if I can read the body language, he wants the puck out to be taken properly. He does, and I don't think he's going to blow it up on the puck out. Brian Lohan is heading up around to all these players there, explaining what's going on, keeping it wide. Yeah, he's going to let the puck out go, I'd say, based on Brian Lohan's reaction with his forwards. So hopefully everybody gets back off the pitch. And we can get going again and Hearts can start racing once more, Marty. How much will Liam Gordon, the referee, allow? Possession for Clare here is crucial. But Limerick have it. Dermot Burns trying to step away. Stopped in his tracks. Tony Kelly, Shane O'Donnell. There's a scramble on the Limerick 45. Trying to get it up in the hurley. Doing good work as Aaron Shannon gives it back. There's the right corner back. He's surely fouled. The referee says no free. And the referee blows the full time whistle. And Clare are protesting that there should have been a free. Limerick yeah. are celebrating that John Kiley in his 11th final previously and won 11 cups, Slivin silverware has done it again. Yeah, Brian Nolan's going out to the referee there. They're off to wait, maybe until he gets him inside. He may have a case, all right. The referee would have taught both player, players, Tony Kelly and the last to be fouled were trying to play for it, I'm not so sure, but either way, just hope the referee can get off the pitch here now. Tim Gordon is coming off. Brian Lohan was quickly in to protest. But there looked to be a foul at the very end. It looked like there could have been a free at the very end. But instead, the referee blew the full-time whistle. And John Kiley and Brian Lohan, I have no doubt, commiserate and celebrate and congratulate each other. Now, was this... This was the incident again. There was a scramble just on the 45-metre line. Aaron Gallagher, Aaron Shanahan got it back. See Tony Kelly there, you see, was crashed into by Casey straight in the chest. And then after that, then of course the clear attacker was bottled up. Claims from the banner obviously will be that the tackle was high around the shoulder, just over the shoulder area. Either way, the result is in the books now, Marty. It sure is.